Storm is coming, casting shadows on the horizon. Cries of change, no warning, lights or siren. Darkened skies are falling, deafening anguish. Enter the abyss, hell is calling. Sharpen your swords, tighten your bows. You are born for this, as you are Spartans. Fly your flags high, give it your all. No fear, no regret to die. Battle for your crest. Fire burns are pumping from your chest. Second is not best. We are more than just man, for we are the Spartans. Okay, everybody, Pro Spartan Gamer, SP Spartan Series, Season 4, hotting up now, getting really down to the nitty gritty. And it's a tough league, tri league trip to Old Trafford, and we've got to get back on the horse. If we lose this one, we definitely won't be top anymore because Manchester United will go above us. We've got Anderlecht then in what should be, hopefully, a fairly easy home leg after taking the 3-1 lead in Belgium to get into the last 32 of the Europa League. So we've got a full-strength side out today. Um, lots of options now, don't forget. Let's make sure we get this right, what we want to do. Bruma's going to come in, he's on red. Yaya Torre. I'd like to involve a couple more players if we can here. Carrasco's going to be rested because he is showing signs of fatigue there. Romanol's showing a few signs of fatigue, but we don't want to bring him in. Arnold as well. So Arnold's going to come out. And Nietzsche's coming in there. Fofana, T.E. Lipton, Lipton and T.E. Lipton coming out and Conti coming in, and Yaya Torre will come on the bench. So a couple little tweaks to the side. Obviously, they are always a threat, and Didier Drogba always seems to score goals against us. So we've got to try and do something about that. We should have a big kit reveal for Season 5 soon as well. Jordan has delivered again. We've sent him off some templates and some colours of what we want made. And he's come back and done a fantastic job, Jordan from Pez World. So hopefully that will be good. Lovely scenes here at Old Trafford. Pouring with rain in Manchester, no change there. Tough, tough nut to crack. This got real importance, this game. Because... At the end of the day, we are top. They are third, two points behind us. I would take a draw now. I'll tell you that now. A draw would not be a bad result here against a good United side. We haven't got to go looking for the win necessarily. We can sit back, take our time. Oh, Lukaku's pace was nearly in behind then. Conti coming in alongside um, Titi today. It's a nice ball. Oh, wouldn't come down for Romano. Just that wet pitch sliding on a bit. Good again from Conte. Got that pace. Not the tallest, but certainly very good at the back. Keeper is going to be a priority to look for to challenge Butlin in the summer. Nice steady start here after 10. Decided that this one will be extended nearly a live con probably. Obviously that's poor. Look at the pace again from Conte. Brilliant defender. Got us out of jail, messing around a bit too much with it. That's good, Bruma. Oh, unlucky. Good tackling back in there. Tyvee looking to put pressure on. Going to be a tight game this. There's not going to be a lot in it. 
Nietzsche unlucky. Got to be a free kick on the edge. Toivy bundled off it. Unceremoniously dumped. Brumer they're saying. 73. Have we got no one better than that who can hit a free kick? Christ, we haven't either. Can't we get anybody else drifting into a position here? We will. We'll knock it to Toivy. Come on. Oh, it didn't work. Keep it in there, though. Gay around the outside, and he will whip in a delicious ball. Oh, Lukaku. Keeping it alive. This is good. This is very good from the Spartans. Lovely play again. Gaia. Oh, thumped the cross. No one there. Conti picks out the pieces. Back to him, Titi. Toivy. Not very good on his left. United breaking in at the moment. Oh, brilliant from Fofana. GG Fofana. Lukaku. Toivy. 1-0. 1-0. Spartans deserve that. And they've got it. And it's Toivy. Who else? Great break, great tackle from Gigi Fofana. If you questioning whether he should still be in the side, don't question it. He's captain fantastic. What a finish from Tyvee. Carmen Cole in the box. As it dropped, he chested it down and absolutely mullered it past Wolfman de Gay. Good play from Brumer. Don't know why Rom ain't going in there with his head. Doesn't matter anyway. Look at this. Strength and control play and a great finish from our mastermind Tyvee. Our master strikesman. Our marksman. 28 gone here. Look at. Oh, Bruma was onto that. Spartans up for this today. They were disappointing against Chelsea. They got told so as well in no uncertain terms. Bruma went and then didn't. Just got to make sure we stay focused here. Good play again from Conte. What good first half he's had. Nietzsche. That's a good knock. Play this, keeping him at arm's length. Good again, Razor Bazaar. That's the ball. Oh, that's the first real danger. Drop down off Drawbar's backside. Good it. Just wide. Keeper was beaten, I think. That's the danger. You can boss the whole 39 minutes of this game and then still end up going conceding. Tyvee. That's lovely. Back to Tyvee. Goal score extraordinarily dangerous coming in here. Oh, I was going to say, don't let him come in there. Touch too much. Once again, Conti there. Brilliant. And Titi, let's get him 1 0 up, boys. That's a great ball. Oh, Tyvee went too early. Good switch between Toivy and Lukaku though. That is tight. Tight as a Buxton pair. Really tight. Really tight in the Brazier. No room for air. 
Tiki. Good. Brilliant first half, boys. Some character. Really have played well there. Really, really a good first half performance. We've seen nothing of their attacking threat. But they might come out a different side in this second half. We know it's a real tense one at Old Trafford. No one really struggling at the moment, but we will need to use the bench. We definitely will be using the bench in this second half. Lovely break. Lukaku! Oh! Real fierce one. Great start from the Spartans. Gaia. What a ball that is. Oh, Bruno Perez. Now we're in trouble. Who's there again, Mr. Conte? That's incredible from Fofana and a tight hole. Perez. Oh, come on. Nice, that's good. Get that out into a bit of space. The gay has caused problems, and once again, it's. Oh, Lukaku just went a little bit too early. But the running behind, and that once again is so tight. So very tight. The Drogba, they like that move. Nietzsche, you've got to be winning them. Good from Perez again. Lukaku, brilliant. Brilliant from Lukaku. Oh, unlucky. Second goal will be massive in this game if it's us who can get it. Bizarre. Bruma on the outside, on the outside. How well does he do there? Fofana. Walk down on the edge, nothing given. They clear it through the Wolfman. Perez brilliantly. Right across the back four. Coming up just past the hour mark now. Nietzsche. Quiet game. Looking for the pace of Tyvin. He's eating at the ground. Back out to Nietzsche. Good football this. Nietzsche. Oh. How close was that to the crucial second goal? Very, very close. Good strike, just bending away. Might be his last action today. We are going to look to make a couple changes now. And we might go two in that defensive midfield role. Fofana's going to stay on. But Nietzsche is coming off. Yaya Torre coming on. And he will play in the defensive midfield. Fofana will... Still stay on in there though. Bruma coming off and it's going to be Boatang coming on. Lukaku coming off. It's going to be Mbola up top. We'll leave Toivy on just for the pace. He might have a rest. In the game against Anderlecht. Real Mbola on. No place for Talaska. He's been poor. And Bowler's pace uh, in behind is what we're looking at. And there he is, straight away in Bowler. Loses it. He's got to get better at keeping hold of the ball. Conti again. He's been composed there. He's been a really good player today for us. 
Toivy once again. Great play from Toivy, ain't got a worry. Bowler bought down, great stuff. Keep the ball, we're winning this 1 0. We are winning this 1 0, and we can take all day about it if we want. Who's got this? Boatang. Yaya Tori, 83. Oof. Tested the hands, didn't quite have enough spunk on it. Yaya, not scored in a spot and shirt this year. Brilliant over there again. Is that Razor? Martial coming on for Bur Burandi. And that will give us a bit of more pace to deal with, no doubt. Good play from Imbola. Overplaying there. Who gets them out of jail? It's Conte. And then looking for the pace of either of the forwards, but again, great defensive play there from good there as well. Toivy. Oh, and Bowler is looking to link with him. Gayer again. won't drop for the second goal that we so desperately yearn here once again Conte w wins it against Drobber in the air and what are you doing there MT he got lucky there that was real risky business Perez caught late nothing given who's there again it's Conte man of the match for me then launches it to get away and it's brewing bowler oh look at the spot and like bees rain a honey pot they know how much this win would mean and it's up again looking for the brew ball from bowler and they have won it. They've won at Old Trafford. It doesn't happen very often. A Tyvee goal after 28 minutes. A sealed a memorable win. What a big result that is in the title chase. Start believing that it could be our year. Second half performance was fantastic defensively. Cot Conti's got to be man of the match. He won't get it, but he should be. Fantastic performance from him at centre-back. And food for thought. No doubt about it. Butlin gets 5.5 and yet he doesn't even concede a goal when he's given a derisory. Everybody should be above at least a 6.5 after a performance like that. What does that mean to the league? It means we've got a bit of a gap over United. I can tell you that much. Five points, I think. Man City win. Liverpool lose to Everton. It's a bit of a surprise. Chelsea beat Tottenham. An Arsenal draw. We are still only two points clear of Man City, but a massive five points now gap back to United now in third. And still only six points clear of dropping out of the top four, which obviously our aim this year is to finish in the top four. Sunderland, Southampton and Derby in trouble down the bottom. Derby definitely gone by the look of it. But surprised that Southampton are there. And Nottingham Forest and Burnley are pulling clear, I must admit. And still whole continue to surprise everybody with their top 10 appearance in ninth we will be back very soon dudes for the home leg against Anderlecht hopefully that's just a formality and then we play Everton in another massive game in the Premier League cheers for jo joining as always dudes Spartans with a memorable night in Manchester cheers yeah, yeah.